check this out, man. We're going to make this real simple, real short, real sweet. You know what I'm saying? My boy Kendrick Lamar has not disappointed us. You know what I'm saying? I woke up to another beautiful, wonderful response diss track that my boy King Kendrick didn't drop. You know what I'm saying? On the nigga Drake. You know what I'm saying? It's called 416 in L.A. Man, come on, man. Y'all got to go check this out. You know what I'm saying? If I ain't never seen a nigga get scorched, you know what I'm saying, and prove this point, well, goddamn it, I done seen it now. You know what I'm saying? Kendrick Lamar shows y'all why he is the king of L.A., the king of California, the king of Compton, the king of hip-hop, the king of rap, period. You know what I'm saying? My nigga has not disappointed us yet. You know what I mean? And to all you dudes that keep on saying, that's jumping out there talking about the West Coast is dead. You know what I'm saying? The West Coast ain't got no lyricists. Nigga, kill that. Kill that. Because if you really believe that in your heart, then you really don't know rap. You really don't know hip hop. And you need to choose a whole different profession. You know what I'm saying? I, I understand we got haters, man. You know what I'm saying? The West Coast been getting hated on for years. You know what I mean? But look, we pass and beyond all that. You know what I mean? We're not just blaming it on one coast. You know what I'm saying? That's hating on the West Coast. You know what I'm saying? We're not even blaming it on a particular group of individuals. We blaming it on single-minded, ignorant, dumb, stupid motherfuckers, man, that don't know music, that don't know hip-hop, that don't know rap. You know what I'm saying? That don't know the different cultural bylaws of this game. You know what I mean? And y'all really need to get out and explore music more a little bit if you don't, man. You know what I mean? Because if you feel in your heart of hearts that Drake had any action at Kendrick Lamar, you know what I mean? After, I'm not just going to say the like that verse or song, you know what I mean? But with the last two tracks that this man just dropped, come on, euphoria. That's overkill within itself, man. And then you follow up. You follow up with 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 616 in LA. Come on, man. Go listen to these tracks. You know what I mean? And you're gonna see why I'm saying what I'm saying. I woke up to a beautiful thing. I told you I've been documenting documenting this here at Swang Low. I've been bringing these battles to the round table. You know what I'm saying? Allowing my people or folks, you know what I'm saying? A fair shot at everybody that's participating and putting themselves in this arena. And guess what? You know what I'm saying? Being that we are a fair people here at Swang Low, everybody get a fair opportunity. I gave everybody a fair chance. You know what I'm saying? But I also let y'all know Hey, I'm a West Coast nigga. You know what I'm saying? Born and raised. I ain't been out this coast. All I know is this coast. But I also understand and appreciate hip hop as a whole. You know what I'm saying? I understand where it was created. You know what I'm saying? Where it was created was a great place. New York is a great place, a great state. You know what I'm saying? With the historical people. You know what I'm saying? And, and just, you know, it's a magical place. You know what I mean? I got love for New York. You know what I mean? So I would never discredit New York for nothing. Do you know what I'm saying? But look, man, don't be mad at us. You know what I'm saying? That's that's on the West Coast or if you're down in the South or wherever you may be, man, for being a prideful people. You know what I'm saying? And very prideful of our artists and, um, you know, our culture and what we stand for, what we go for and what we go, don't go for. You know what I'm saying? It's many levels to this gangsterism. You don't have to be a crip or a blood to be a gangster. You know what I'm saying? As people are proving that every day, you don't have to be gang affiliated to be a gangster. That ain't what gangsterism is. You know what I'm saying? The true essence of gangsterism don't even wasn't even formed around no gangs. You know what I mean? So do y'all history check, man, and understand, man. You know what I'm saying? Right now, these backpack rappers is resurfacing and they showing y'all why you know some of them have made it to the levels that they've made it you know what i'm saying do i consider drake kendrick lamar to be backpack rappers you know what i'm saying well it's different categories of of different um styles of rap 
you know what I'm saying? But these men have definitely, um, you know, uh, grew to a certain status in, in, in the music game, you know what I'm saying, to where you will easily be able to try to place them in certain categories, you know what I'm saying, um, whether it be gangsterism, whether it be backpack rap or what they used to reference, you know what I'm saying, dudes that wasn't gang affiliated, that was more into, deeper into hip hop, you know, they called them backpack rappers, you know what I'm saying, battle rappers now these days is what they're known as. You know what I mean? But, hey, I got love and appreciation for every form of, of the rap game, period, which is why I indulge in it so heavily. You know what I'm saying? Because I live it. You know what I'm saying? I, I dream it. I, this is everything to me. You know what I'm saying? And even when I'm not involved with it, personally, I am involved with it. You know what I'm saying? That's what Swang Low is. Hip hop and entertainment. You know what I'm saying? And lifestyle. That's what we stand on. That's what we stand for. That's what we about, you know what I'm saying? So we cover it all, you know what I mean? And I'm here to let y'all know that I've been saying it from the very get-go that I knew King Kendrick was going to deliver for us, you know what I'm saying, and not disappoint, you know what I'm saying? Am I a biased person because I'm from the West Coast? Maybe that's the case, or maybe it's that I understand, you know what I'm saying, how historical, you know what I'm saying, this beef is between these two artists because I understand how great they both are. You know what I'm saying? And never discrediting anybody from my coast that deserve it. You know what I'm saying? And trust me, man. Come on, man. Hands down. King Kendrick deserve all the accolades and some. You know what I mean? Because he crushed Drake. He crushed him. He crushed him like a like an old ass, old English king. You know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about one of them regular regular crushes. I'm talking about, you know what I'm saying? You drain the old English until everything is gone. You know what I'm saying? And then you set the can on the ground, man, and you just use all your might to just step on it and just crush it all the way down to nothing. Then you kick it to the side. You know what I'm saying? That's what Kendrick Lamar did to Drake. You know what I mean? So go check out Euphoria. You know what I'm saying? And then double back like King Kendrick did and hit a nigga with that 616 in LA, you know what I'm saying? And you're gonna see why I say he buried him. You know what I mean? Now, I understand the Drake fans is gonna be out there going crazy, running wild, you know what I'm saying? Trying to discredit, you know what I'm saying? Kendrick for whatever, but you can't discredit greatness. You know what I'm saying? You can't dispute it. You can't push it to the side. You can't silence it, you know what I mean? Not when it's this powerful, you know what I'm saying? So this is my reaction. You know, to 616 in L.A., King Kendrick Lamar, you know what I'm saying? Smashing Drake. Drake, man, hey, ain't no recovery, my nigga. Leave it alone. You can't win. Point blank, period. No matter what you do. You know what I'm saying? But, hey, man, everybody that's checking this video out, like, comment, and subscribe, please. All that do matter. And it's all free. Like, comment, and subscribe is all free, man. You know what I'm saying? Do Rock Creep Swang Low Podcast Show, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? We the new voice, the 626 San Gabriel Valley and beyond. We the new voice, man. You got to come through here to be somebody. Point blank, period. You know what I'm saying? Until our next reaction and video, love y'all, man. Triple gang.